Hey guys, it's Sarah and welcome back to my channel. Today's deal comes to you from Walgreens. So I finally got the spend 20, get $5 in Walgreens cash digital. I haven't gotten that in a few weeks. So I was super excited to see that pop up on my account. I decided to take advantage of that and to do some Ibotta rebates. If you're new to my channel, thank you so much for tuning in. I do shop at places like Walgreens, CVS, Walmart, Target, Kroger, pretty much you name it and I'm there. I don't have a Rite Aid in my area, but that's about all that I don't have. So if you're new, I always leave a printable breakdown in the description box down below, as well as links to different rebate apps. So check those out if you'd like. And when you use my links to sign up for those apps, it helps me and it helps you. So thank you guys so much for doing that. All right, so let's jump right into these deals. I did two separate transactions. One was a curbside pickup order, but let's start with my in-store order. The first thing I knew I wanted was a holiday card because I received a fantastic digital, $2 off of a any Hallmark holiday card that was at least $2 in value. So I grabbed up one that was two for four. It rang up $2. I will be honest with you guys, my $2 digital did not come off. I did have to contact customer service, but they credited me the $2 in Walgreens cash. And I just thought that was a super cute card. So that is going to my boyfriend's granddaughter. Hopefully she likes it. So that made that completely free after the digital coupon. The next deal I did, this was another little issue I had, the Trident Mega Sugar-Free Gum. These were showing online as three for $3. They were also showing in the store as three for $3, but I didn't notice till I checked out, they ring up $1.79 each. Not sure what's up with that. I did contact customer service. They gave me an email address actually when I did the live chat. So I emailed my question to them and I'm still awaiting a response. At any rate, if these are three for three, and if your store will match what it says on the shelf, then you can grab up three of these and use a 50 cent off of two digital coupon. You'll pay 250 out of pocket, but then submit to Ibotta. My Ibotta app had $1.99 back when you buy two, making all three of these packs 51 cents or just 17 cents a piece. Fantastic deal. Then we have the dial. Um, the refills, the hand, hand wash refills. So these are $5.99 for the two pack. We have a $2 digital bringing our out of pocket cost to $3.99. Submit to Ibotta, my app had $2 back. And then submit to Shopkick, I received $1.88 back, making this just 11 cents. And this last deal, I'm sure a lot of you have heard of, I've seen it all over the internet. Um, the Oral-B toothbrushes, select kinds are $4 and the $4 ones are buy two, get a $4 register reward. I grabbed up three, as you can see, they were $4 each. So three would cost $12, but I had a five off of three digital coupon. Total out of pocket was $7. Submitted to Ibotta, got back $2 for each of these. So a total of $6 back. And then I did get my register reward. I went to a different store and this printed for me. If you guys have been watching my videos, you know that the store I usually shop at does not always have a reliable Catalina machine. So very excited that that printed. So after getting that back and my cash back from Ibotta, these toothbrushes were free and a $3 money maker. But that is before our spend 20, get $5 Walgreens cash digital. So subtotal before coupons for this transaction was $22.99 if the, the gum had rung up correctly. Subtotal after coupons was $13.49 if everything comes off. If not, just contact customer service and they usually will credit you in Walgreens cash. I got back $5.23 in Walgreens cash, $1.88 from Shopkick, a $4 register reward, and a total of $9.99 from Ipada. Wow. Making my final cost completely free and a $7.61 moneymaker for this transaction. So excited about that. 
even with my hiccup there, the gum ended up costing me a, a little over $2 more than what I had planned. It's still a money maker, guys. So very excited. Then I did a curbside pickup order and I decided to grab up the Palmolive. They're on a promotion, the 20 ounce bottles for, um, let's see, I didn't write it down. Oh, buy two, get $3 in Walgreens cash. So I noticed that the lavender and lime were a little bit cheaper at the store that I purchased them from online. Not sure if that's the case across the board, but I went with that particular scent. I mean, it sounds awesome anyway, and it looks awesome. I think the purple is really pretty, but yeah, it was a little bit cheaper. It was $2.49. And so two of those would be $4.98. I used a 75 cent digital on one. And then I used code WAG10, which took 10% off after that digital. So it took 42 cents off, making my total out of pocket $3.81. But then I got back my $3 in Walgreens cash, which made these 81 cents for both or about 40 cents a bottle. That is phenomenal for a 20 ounce palm olive. Then the Carol's Daughter, I've never tried this product. If you guys have, let me know what you think of it. Um, this is black vanilla. Let's see if I can get this to focus. It is hydrating leave-in conditioner, guys. It's two ounces, so it's a little spray. Um, it's $2.99, and we have a $2 digital attaching to this. And when you use code WAG10, you get an additional 10 cents off, making this just 89 cents. So that could make for a really nice little stocking stuffer if you have um, someone who appreciates the leave-in conditioner, maybe a teenager. And then the last thing I grabbed in my curbside pickup order was the Walgreens Soothe. So this is similar to Pepto-Bismol, just something that's nice to have on hand. You don't want to have to run out and buy this when you actually need it. So the 8 ounce is priced at $3.29 online. I used a $2 digital and then that code WAG10 took an additional 13 cents off, making this just $1.16. And the reason I threw that in, in part, was to get my transaction above $10. If you do a curbside pickup, you have to place an order that's at least $10 worth. So my subtotal before coupons for these four items was $11.26. My subtotal after coupons was $5.86. You can use Walgreens cash to pay, so I used $5 in Walgreens cash to pay. I also went through Rakuten, guys. When I placed this order, Rakuten was giving 10% back. And you can pay with Walgreens cash and they'll still give you 10% back. So I actually got a dollar and six cents back from Rakuten. And then I got a total of $3 and 17 cents back in Walgreens cash, which made my final cost for this transaction just a dollar 63. That is amazing. So when you look at the money maker we had here and the small cost here, our final cost for everything was free and a $5.98 moneymaker before tax. It ended up still being completely free and a moneymaker after tax as well. So very excited. And this printed for me. So excited about that. Haven't had one of those in a hot minute. So I might be going back to Walgreens later this week, guys. So stay tuned. If you haven't subscribed, haven't hit that notification bell, you might want to do so because I post pretty randomly. I do work full time. I have a whole lot else going on in life, as I'm sure most of you do as well. Um, but at any rate, I love bringing you guys these deals. So if you like this video, feel free to give it a thumbs up. Thank you guys so, so much for watching and liking and commenting. And until next time, guys, happy couponing.